Hi, dear friends, Chris here. So today I decided, um, kind of impromptu, well, I decided last night, but I decided to do it early today, and so I hope I'm going to get all this information out and correct, and, you know, uh, so yesterday, as you probably, oh, hopefully, maybe have seen, um, I did an unboxing for, uh, FG Normal, and I had, um, done my, uh, Two of the canvases were what I call bubble rounds and so you know I got some comments on it and very nice and um, so I just wanted to go in more depth of what they are how to buy them where to find them how to search them out what they exactly they are so first let's start with what they are again and this is only for anyone who knows so here is the canvas just a plain canvas so let me first explain that I kind of coined the term bubble round so you won't find that on the any website you know that that's not going to show up if you try to search for it you might get a picture of an actual bubble you know <laughs> so it, it's not really a searchable term for the specific kind of diamond painting it is um, they basically again you'll find them under special shape the special shape section um, they could be, you know, sometimes I have the word crystal in their name, um, rhinestone, that kind of thing. So, but I, um, call them bubble rounds because how they look. So I'll give you the few examples I have here. So this is one of them. Now, if you could see, they look like bubbles. They have different sizes. They have... The regular size, which is right there. The regular rhinestone size, that's that one. Then right next to it, that's the next size up. So I call that size 2. And then the last one is the size 3, the largest one. And so this is how they look. And generally, the bubble rounds are a whole... Uh, in essence, a full drill. Um... Again, if you've seen that, as I said, sometimes that maybe that little space like right there, that's not diamond painted. But this one specifically has glue on that star. So you can add your own leftover rhinestones to it if you want, or you could just leave it blank. Um, that one just happens to be sticky over there. <laughs> um, but so that's what they are. So and these kind of paintings generally come like this. They're very small. See if you compare them. This one is the regular standard size 30 by 40. I, I'm kind of really close, so I know I'm not getting a great example here. But if you see this comparative wise, you know, so this is either like a 15 by 15 or 50 by 20. I don't know. I don't have my measure tape here. You know, and again, I have three of them that are completed. And generally, they come, a lot of these come in these tiny ones, and they're very, like, kid-like or juvenile, you know. And, you know, that's fine. I mean, they're cute and all, and I, I enjoy doing them. There's no issue with that. But, you know, listen, it would be great to have a more adult-type image like this, and, you know, mountains and the, sun, the stars and all that. So... Um, they also have a few big one, bigger ones. Now, this is like a 30 by 30, something like that. And again, this is a, you know, a little hill there with the background and this, um, basically the heart tree. And this one has some special shapes in it. So as you can see, they have the little Marquis de Sade things and they have the, the pink hearts. Let's see. Okay. Um... So, and again, it's basically, this is a full coverage, you know, um, painting. And so they're super fun and they don't have a lot of that. My issue was they don't have a lot of them. You know, they have the kitty ones and they only have like a handful. Previously, they only had a handful of these 30 by 30s. Um, there's this one. There's um, one you can get another tree one that has like gold you know where you see how where these green is they have like this gold um seed looking drills they have one of a dove you know they have a penguin a little penguin one that looks like happy feet kind of thing so 
I was super excited when they came out with more of these in the larger sizes. Okay, so that's exactly what a bubble round is. It's it's a it's a crystal painting that has the three different sizes and the cool thing is, of course, like I said, they look like bubbles. That's why they have the name that I gave them. <laughs> um, <coughs> excuse me. So, let's see. Um, what else can I tell you? Because I'm going to just show you now how to find them. Uh, let's see. So, I think that's kind of the first part that I wanted to tell you this is going to be a little tricky, tricky because my iPad is in front of me popped up and I'm having to work on my laptop you know uh, in front of it okay so now when we look for them this is kind of like everybody says the issue so you can oops actually let me go away Let's see. Let's see, we go to special shape drills. So this is what comes up. This is from the FG Normal site. I went under the thing here, of course, just in case you didn't, I should say that. The tab, the diamond painting tab, and then I went to special shaped. Now, over here, it has all products and featured. So I put, I usually use two, um, two things in this category. I tend to use date, new to old, because the new stuff will show up first, or I use price high to low. Um, usually, <laughs> you don't want to use high, get high prices. However, in diamond paintings, you know, the larger ones are usually, we all like the larger ones, <laughs> and they're usually the better ones and everything. So, um, I tend to want to search out the higher ones first. So, let's just do that. So these will come up. So these are more like, um, like this one, the 45 by 85 canvas of Paris. You have the, these big peacock ones. Oops. Yeah, 110 by 45. And so in this, we'll have some special drills somewhere. Okay. So that's the one I use a lot uh, in the sort by area. But let's go to new to old. So... As of today, which is uh, June 18th, 2021, these are the new products that are in. So we scan through. This is all they have. Mm -hmm. So now we find. So obviously, none of these, if you could. This is like the picture. And a lot of times, which is kind of good about the special shapes, is that they sometimes tend to show you the product with the drills or with the the rendering like you could see in this one for instance you could see the the um time painting you could see the the dry, the rhinestones basically on or you could see the big special drills here so you can kind of decipher whereas they never really do that with rounds and squares so now we come on to this. Now we can see, okay, so what is this? This says it's a flower and paints partial. So let's open it to see what this is. So this is the main one. So I could tell this is just a regular partial just by the... Uh, um, I know you can't tell as because you're not as close. But I could see that they have... These are the special drills on here. These are the rhinestones. This area is empty. So this is not going to be a bubble round. So keep scrolling. Next page. So I actually looked on this yesterday because this was a beautiful image. I thought, ooh, is this something I'd like? This FG Normal, I like them, but they have so many pop-ups. Okay, so this is a really beautiful image of a crane and the Mount Fuji and the, the sun and all that. So now what we do go to the pictures. This is another tip for any diamond painting, not just bell browns, any diamond painting. If you're buying them, it doesn't matter if it's on a budget friendly site or the premium of premium sites. Always try to look to see what the rendering will be. So go in the pictures that they provide on the on the 
the product uh, page that you click on and look throughout the pictures. Now these, all these are redundant because this is the main picture right here, the first one that you see up top. Listen, and then they have these one hanging on walls. They have this big frame one, wall, wall. I don't know why they put all these there. These are, they don't even need to put those there. They should be taken off. We need to see this one basically. They want to show the little picture of diamonds and this one. So this is the picture of the rendering. So again, no matter what size you get, no matter where it's from, always look to see what it looks like, what the canvas looks like without the drills. This is what the canvas looks like without the drills. It'll help you with clarity. It'll help you to see what kind of drills in this kind of instance. So th now this is a beautiful picture, but I would never get it. There's hardly any drills on that. As you can see, the sun is the only thing that's outlined, and they have a couple in the flowers and a couple in the mountains. No, this is to me not worth the 485 US dollars. So I say no. It's a beautiful, beautiful picture, but no. And I know that's not obviously a bulb around either. Okay, let's move on. Now, this was the same thing. Oop, you can't see this. This was so pretty, and I clicked on it immediately because I thought, oh, is that one of those new wreaths? wreaths that they released but it's not see let me just show you real quick and again this is what's good about searching the pictures so here we have again the beautiful picture of this hibiscus um they call it a garland and then you go down to the pictures and to the rendering and what do you see it's just a special shape painting not the wreath that they have so let's no. Okay, add, go away. Oops, I didn't mean to do that. Okay, I gotta go back. These pop-ups. I'm just trying to find you one. Uh... Okay, so I think is this one? This why it's always good to look. I don't know. N no. Nope. See, as you could see, just a regular special shape. Okay. <laughs> Don't worry, they're here. I've seen them. Oh, maybe I have to go on a different one of the other ones, though, to find what I'm actually looking for. I don't know. They should be here. Okay, let's look at this one. This is a mandala. Now, just looking at the picture itself. Okay, see, it's closer up. This is just a regular mandala. However, this is a great one because there's a lot of... The drill area is, again, fantastic. I mean, it's basically, again, almost all covered. See, I would get this one. This Not only is it beautiful, but there's so much of the, the area is covered, which is important for me for partials. So, you know, it, it might seem like a lot if, you know, if you don't have patience to look, but you just have to keep going, scrolling through the new stuff. Um, they might not have, re like I said, I, a few companies released the other two um, that I have up here. Fan Cells and Peggy Buy released new stuff yesterday, so maybe FG Normal didn't um, release new stuff yet. Um, the stuff that I'm looking for. So, because I'm at page 9 now, so um, I'm going to probably have to go over there and check. Okay. 
So let's go over here. New for diamond paintings. Again, recommended. Newest in. Again, these are the new ones. Ah, see? First one comes up right here. The first page on Peggy Buy. Now I can see this says 18 by 18 crystal special shaped diamond painting dog with frame. Now this one comes with a little frame. It's $12.99. I wouldn't buy this myself because for the 18 by 18, which is probably something around this size, um, for $13, that's a lot just to, um, just because you get this little frame with it. Um, now this is kind of, this is considered, would be considered a bubble round. Um, again, I'm looking for the rendering. There it is, down in the pictures. Oops. Okay. Because you can see in the background, I don't know if you can see it, like right on here where the cursor is. There's the largest one, and then I can see the next, the second size one, and the regular ones. So, this is a bubble, a bubble round. It's a new one. And it's actually of one of my old babies, the King Charles Cavalier Spaniels. It's adorable. So that is one. That's a new one. Again, like you, like I said, um, just look through the pictures. Uh, okay, here we are. We have a couple more. We have this one. Again, and another tip too when searching, if, when you're searching for them, a lot of them tend to have the similar... Especially with um, then ones that, well, this is kind of a kid one, but especially one with the more, if you want to say adult ones, they tend to have the similar type design, especially in the background. If you look at this, see these circles here in the background. You see on this one, this is how the circle is. And you could say the tree, a lot of them have the similar type thing. Now, if you can see the on here, obviously the, this, the background's not that way, but you can see the circle here. Um, and again, on this one, the background, see how it's, it has the circle there? So a lot of them tend to have the de are designed kind of like that. So let's pop over to this one. Now, this one might not actually be one. It looks like it just may be a regular rhinestone one. No, it is. They're, they do have... It's not as prominent, though, but there are some bigger bigger ones here and they t this one it tends to show probably like in this blue section here is maybe one size the yellow section is one size blue section one size pink section one size maybe but um yeah you could you can tell again it is a rhinestone bubble round type thing again this is the one with the frame now this this other one is not oops is not a um, one with the frame so this is one of the newer ones. This is the 30 by 30, which again is this size. Why is it taking so long to load the page? Okay, so this is designed and really cute. We have the background, we have the guitar with this tree coming out of the guitar. So let's go down to the pictures. Okay. Oh. No, it doesn't want to cooperate. Okay. So here we can see more clearly. This kind of, like I said, looks like the mountain one that I've been showing you. You could see back here, different sizes. I forgot my screen is a touch can use this with my finger. I rarely ever do that. Um, you can see the in the guitar into the trunk, tree trunk area, that's the small ones, which are the regular size. Then you can see in here in the background, they have the two different other sizes plus the small size. So th again, these are some of the new ones. And again, look at the patterns. Um, now I'm going to show you um, how to find them by typing in the search. So, you want um, what I tend to do is two things. I'll put full special f 
crystal special shape. Now, on this one, what comes up is a hundred, a thousand, about eleven hundred results. Well, that's way too many to look through on uh, F2 normals. I mean, you can, that's for sure. But what does come up, it comes up sporadically. For instance, these come up. Now, these are not going to be, for instance, let's open them. I don't believe these are the bubble rounds. Let's see. Oh. Now, this one does not have a rendering on it, unfortunately. So, oh, but it does have the drills on it. Okay. So, they're calling this full special shaped drill diamond painting. But if you look at it, again, if you, you could see, it's not really full. This is a partial. There's plenty of area where there's empty, the, even the, where the drills are. They're, they're sporadic. You know, they're not close together. So, you can see all this empty space here, here in the background. So, that's not really true. That's why if you like something, you should click on it and see what it is. Or if you have an idea, it might be that. See, this is the one I have that I've been showing you, um, which is the heart tree. Again, there you go. You could tell. Uh, this is one too. I can't make it bigger. Okay, not on this one. But you can tell, okay, there's a lot of normal size drills here. And in the background, you can see some small, uh, bigger ones. This is one I just, I bought. Uh, you haven't seen it yet. I haven't um, shown the unbagging. But um, I did buy this one because I don't know when this came out, but I just seen it. And again, you know, a lot different sizes here, different sizes here. All right. So that's what will come up. Uh, uh, sometimes a lot will come up in you know, thir 113 pages, you know. All right, let's get away from that site. So let's go to Peggy Buy. Let's try it. Full special shape. Okay. Full special shape. No projects available. Or n no projects yet. So, um, that means, let's see, what's the other one? Um, let's see. F full crystal. Nope, nothing's coming up for that either. So, because I know they do have them here, let me look what they call them uh, okay so this is one I got from FG normal to review yesterday so crystal special shape so that's how Peggy by calls them so let's type that in so when you type in on Peggy by full uh, excuse me, crystal, crystal special shape. These come up. Now, this is a new one just released. That's a bubble round. I could tell. This is the new one. That's a bubble round. This, I don't think is. Nope, that's not. This is just a regular special shaped one. That's not. That's a regular one too. I could tell. This is a new one. 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 These are bubble rounds. Again, I could tell by the style. You could tell if you look. Again, most of these will have the diamonds on them, which is good. So you know what 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 it is. This, these are all bubble rounds. I checked these out. And this one probably is not one. I could kind of tell. Wow, you know this. My computer. I have pretty good service here, but I don't know why. I'm having such a difficult time with the connection today. It never takes this fast. Things usually pop right up. <laughs> no, see, this is a regular one. So it's always good just to check. I know this one is for sure. This one is for sure. This one is for sure. 
Um, again, more. These are bubble round, bubble round, bubble round. Bubble round, I believe. Yep. Again, you, th there's a lot of, with this pattern, you could tell. I see how, if you tell how um, so many of these look the same sort of pattern, see? The circular patterns. The All these are... So that's kind of um, my little tutorial. Um, again, I w if you go on one of these sites, if you don't want to look through what's new, you know, because that could be, you're looking through all their new products, but if you want to look just specifically for this, type crystal special shape or full special shape, and that will help you um, find them. Again, some sites um, might have different um, things come up. Like I said, for instance, when I put full, like you saw, I put full special shape in Peggy Vi, it didn't come up. N nothing came up. Crystal special shape, it came up. Now, uh, like I said, they'll, they, there will be some regular special shapes in here, but th most of these are the whole bubble round full ones. Now, in fan cells, I can put full special shape, and these are all bubble rounds that come up. There's it's 216 matches. So far, all of these are bubble rounds. These are little kitty ones, small ones, 15 by 15, 15 by 15s. These are newer ones. You're getting preview of some of the stuff I bought. Again, all of these are that you've seen are bubble around so far. Then we go into keychains and other such items, but there might be more, but there's more over here, down here, like this one, this is, again, these are. So that's just my, again, going on 30 minutes, that's my long explanation on something that could have probably been a lot shorter, but so that's what a bubble round is. Don't search for the term bubble round, you won't find it. You have to search for full special shaped or crystal special shape in the search box. Always check the new, uh, when if you go on these sites, you could always look also look at the new um, in areas. And also these are always going to be under special shape if you want to try to find them. Um, they're not considered round or square, so they're considered special shape. And finally, um, Again, I reiterate this with every single diamond painting you buy or are interested in. You can find the, the be most beautiful design that you're interested in, but you have to check to see if they show you a rendering because it might you as you might love the artwork. Like let's say you love this artwork, but you let's say you click on it and it looks horrible. Well, th then you just kind of wasted money if you didn't check the artwork. Now, again, not every single piece will have the rendering, but a lot of them nowadays do show you renderings of the um, painting or the of, of the canvas like this. So you could see what it looks like and you could tell if it's a bubble around or not. I hope this was... Expl uh, I was going to say something else, but... Um, <laughs> I hope this explained the whole um, kind of dime painting of the bubble round. Again, it's my favorite. I love doing it. Um, I'm so happy they're coming out with so many newer ones that aren't just towards kids. And, um, you know, I, I hope this explained everything. If you need to know... Or if you want to know anything, if you need to know anything, if you have any questions or comments um, that I didn't maybe cover in this video or didn't make clear, etc., etc., just leave me a comment and I'll try to answer your question as best I can. I tried to come up with everything uh, this morning that uh, I thought was relevant and that I needed to tell you, so I hope I didn't forget anything. So again, if you have any other further questions on how to search, how to find them, um, if I forgot anything, um, just let me know and I will answer the question below in the comments. All right. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you found this helpful.
And I'm sorry it went on for so long, but, you know, that's what you get when you watch me. <laughs> All right, till next time, guys. Be safe, be happy, stay safe, stay happy. Bye, guys.